How's it going guys and welcome to your first video in a series where I'll be showing you how to code an Arduino. So I'm going to assume that you have the Arduino software installed on your computer. If you haven't, you can go to arduino.cc and press on the software section. From here you can scroll down and you want to download the Arduino IDE. So select your, uh, your platform, Windows, uh, Mac or Linux and once that's installed you can, uh, you can open it up and you should see a screen similar to this one right here. So this is the Arduino IDE. Inside here is where you put all your code for your program and from there it'll be uploaded to your Arduino. So firstly you want to connect the Arduino to this software. So you want to firstly just plug your Arduino into your computer. Uh, once that's done, you can go to the tools section up top here. Uh, go down to, to port. And then you want to select from here uh, the port. So one of these drop downs which has the Arduino text in brackets next to it. So for me it was COM3, Arduino, Genuino, Uno. So press on that one right there. And that right there will connect your Arduino to this software. Now on the bottom right you can see we have the Arduino on COM3. And that's your confirmation that it's all connected. Now up here we have two separate sections. We have the void setup uh, section and the void loop section. Now these two are called functions. And functions are basically just blocks of code to be executed. Now in between these brackets here this is the code that is part of the function. So the setup function will run all the code inside these two brackets. And the same goes for the loop function. Now the setup function will run once right after you upload the code to your Arduino. So the setup section uh, runs once. Now the loop section will run repeatedly as the Arduino stays on. So keep that in mind. We have this code here runs once, the loop runs repeatedly. Now you can put all your code inside here. And same goes for the, for the loop function. So what we're going to do in the next video is make it so uh, we're going to use these two functions and send messages from the Arduino to the computer. And this is going to be like text. We can send, hello, how's it going? Or, you know, we can, we can send messages to the computer. But that's all for this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later.